Hello and welcome to our PadShare walkthrough. PadShare is a cloud system for pattern and marker making. You'll be able to create, save, edit, and share your work through PadShare. Open your browser and enter the URL share.patsystem.com. To get started, simply fill in the name of your share, anything is fine, your email and password, and click start. Your new share account is now set up. But before you can start, you'll need to verify your email address. Be sure to check both your inbox and spam folders. Once you've verified your email, you can get started. You can edit your share settings, create stores, and add access at any time by clicking the edit button. Think of your share as a storage unit and your stores as individual filing cabinets in that storage unit. Now you can access your share and the stores within anywhere, anytime through a browser. So. Enter a store, and the next thing you need to do is to download the pad agent. This allows you to open your pattern and marker files. Download by clicking the cloud button on the top right hand corner of the page. Once downloaded and installed, you will be able to create a new pattern or marker files or upload your files onto PadShare by clicking the add button. Let's create a pattern file. Choose Pattern from the drop-down menu. Type in your file name and click OK. The pattern design client that you downloaded with the pad agent will open automatically to allow you to start working. Once you've completed your design and saved, you'll find that the file is now available in your store. To create a marker from that pattern file, Copy the work ID, then click the add sign again, and this time choose marker. Type in the file name. Once the marker program opens, paste the work ID you've copied using Control V, or if you're using Mac, Command V, confirm and start the marker program. Once you've closed the program, you'll notice the gold lock on the corner of the file. This means that someone is currently using the file, or since you've just closed it, the file is currently saving or loading onto your store, so you can't open it yet. Finally, you can invite people to your store to see or work on your projects together. Click the invite button on the top right corner and enter their email. You can also choose what access rights they have to your store. Finally, click the send to send out the invitation. They will now receive an email asking them to join your store with a link and password attached.